Welcome to the Bentley Systems training course where you will learn how to use STAD Advanced Concrete Design to design the concrete beams for a structure that has already been created in STAD Pro. Now before creating, now before performing the design in STAD Advanced Concrete Design, we need to go ahead and take a look at the loading information. To start that process, let's go to the settings menu bar option and select the basic load cases. Now all of the member forces and plate loads for each load case in the analyzed STAD Pro model will be imported into STAD Advanced Concrete Design. Once in this program, you can specify the type of load for each load case. So we're gonna go ahead and specify the load type for each of the load cases that were created in the STAD Pro model and brought into STAD Advanced Concrete Design. Once we're done entering the load types, we're gonna select all of the load cases and move them over to the selected area. This will let the program know that you intend to use these particular load cases for the design of the concrete beam. You're also gonna get enter the category of your ladder loads for both earthquake loads and wind loads if applicable. This will give the program information on how to generate the load combinations. Once we've addressed the basic load cases, we're also going to enter our load combination information. Now you can add your load combinations from your analysis file if you already created your concrete design load combinations that would be appropriate, or you can generate them directly within STAD Advanced Concrete Design using the load cases from the analysis file. We're gonna go ahead and generate our load combinations directly in STAD Advanced Concrete Design for regular structures. We'll be able to review all of those load combinations and then we'll go ahead and click OK. Now one thing I wanna discuss before we leave the topic of loading. For this particular model, we decided to group our concrete beams vertically across a series of typical levels. And we can see that the level at Y equals 12 feet, 24 feet, and 36 feet were brought over from the STAD Pro model. And these levels are typical and geometrically identical. Now, when the program goes ahead and performs the design, the design force envelope will be computed for each section across each level and across multiple load combinations. Now, at this point in our workflow, we have sent our model data over from our analysis model. We have entered all of our settings and addressed our load cases and combinations. We are now ready to perform a design and STAD Advanced Concrete Design. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.